Hey you, welcome to Slay the Spire. Today we're playing the daily challenge for May 1st, 2022. The character of the Watcher and the modifier star All Star start with 5 colorless cards. Time dilation, all enemies start with the slow debuff. And binary card rewards contain only 2 cards. I see Flick Nickum here, 7th place, really good, 1403. Pretty good score. Vorpal and Sita with 1353 and 1330. And Desmond Citizen, uh, Denizen, sorry, with 1328. So pretty good scores there. Let's review the scores from yesterday. I did not do too great. Um, I don't see any familiar names in the top 20, though. So I'm guessing a lot of people had trouble. Oh, yeah. Sita Computer ended up with 39th. It was 1645. Where did I end up? 61st. Okay, that's not too bad. Turbo Andrew a little further above and Vorpal a little further above. Steven a little further below. All right, all right. Not not a bad run yesterday, but yeah, definitely was lots of rooms for improvement and looks like others had as much trouble as I did. All right, let's move on to today's run. So Watcher with All-Star and Time Dilation. Oof. Uh, with Binary, Collector Bonuses might be difficult. So I might have to remove one of the all Jackal all trades. But other than that, this, this looks decent. Probably can try to remove the Chrysalis, and then if I can, also remove the Violence to go for the um, Popper modifier. But let's start with the Jackal all trades first. All right, so one, two, three, four. Look at that, a four elite path. Okay, yeah, middle. Uh, not a lot of question mark rooms, but I think with the Watcher, especially on Act 1, um, having lots of elites should be a, should be fine. I guess perfecting might be a uh, difficulty. All right, let's start with Jack of All Trades Finesse. Because of the slow debuff, I want to play as much as of the zero-cost cards as possible. Can I kill here? So already this does seven, right? So it's 28 plus another 11. That's 39. I think it should be enough, especially if I play the Miracle, right? Yeah, awesome. Okay. Crush Joints, Serving Fury. I wouldn't mind another way to enter Wrath, but this is sort of delayed Wrath, right? Let's go with the Crush Joints first. The Vulnerability will definitely help. Okay, I got the Elise here. Let's do the two Jack Wall traits. Um, let's Secret Weapon the Eruption, then do Enlightenment. And then I can play, uh, wait, can I kill? Yeah, I can kill the backline, right? Let's do Eruption, Crush Joints, and then Strike. Good. Tranquility Evaluate. I wouldn't mind having a way to exit Wrath, so let's take the Tranquility. Who's my final boss, by the way? Sorry about that. Okay, Slime is at the end. So it should be fine, especially for the Watcher with the um, with the Eruption that I have. Let's do Finesse. Oof, not the best hand here. Let's do Vigilant, just so I can um, have a lot of energy once I have the Eruption. Which I was really hoping would be this turn, but no. I guess I'll do defend and then strike, strike, swift strike. Okay. And then, uh, well, violence will draw the eruption, right? Let's do that. Jack of all trades gives me... Um, actually, I'm pretty sure I can kill here. Good. All right, crescendo. Okay, well, if I pick up the tranquility, let's also pick up a crescendo. Although, hmm, maybe I should try to pick up more offensive cards in case I fight the Grumman knob. So, let's see... I'm trying to figure out a way. I, I think if I enter Wrath, I might end up taking too much damage. So Strike would kill one of them, but I don't think it'll kill the other Lice, right? And then I'll still take 12 damage. Yeah, fine. Let's just do Defend, and then I'll do Strike and Strike. Okay. All right, 16. Look at that. Let's do Finesse, Strike, Kills, and then Double Defend. Okay. Hmm. And then here I can do Crush... Actually, let's do Crush Joints later. I think I, that should be enough to kill. Oh, actually, I should probably just do Crescendo. That'll make my life easier too, right? Crush Joints kills you, and the Strike kills you. Good. Okay. Empty Fist. Yeah, perfect. Attack card allows me to exit my stance. All right, and I guess I don't have any good AOE cards, so this might be a little annoying. Let's do Defend Crush Joints uh, you, and then Strike is enough to kill. Okay. Unfortunately, this guy makes me weakened, which is annoying. Uh, eruption violence. Uh, I guess I can... I don't want to do eruption. Well, I could do eruption and do empty fist, right? So that's a miracle. Um, eruption. Uh, you empty fist is 17. That's almost enough. I think I'm going to risk it by striking you and then doing empty fist. Oh, 18. That's not enough. Uh, I'm going to take an annoying amount of damage. Uh, I miscalculated. I should have realized that the... Um, wait, so the Empty Fist is less than 10 damage, which means that every 10% extra I get is less than 1 extra damage. So I was hoping for 2. That didn't happen. Uh, let's do Vigilance here, and um, I, I guess I'll wait. 
Alright, I should also kill the shield gremlin too. Alright, secret weapon. Let's get an eruption. Kill you and then uh you I guess. Alright. And then I can double defend here. No way to no reason to exit wrath that way I can kill. This is taking me way too long. I'll just uh hurry it up. Okay, got an energy potion. Flying sleeves is fine. I don't have any scry synergies just yet. Okay, sentries with no slow debuff. Oh boy. Alright, let's do Jack of all trades blind. That's good. Um but then I, I still will get attacked by six, which I can't fully defend against. Can I kill somehow? If I do eruption, crush joints, and empty fist, how much is that? So that's nine, sixteen, and eighteen, twenty-seven. So thirty-five, forty-five. Yeah, that would actually be enough, right? So let's try that. That's my only chance of perfecting. So let me do miracle blind, then crush joints, and then empty fist. Okay. Next turn I have 27, or uh, not 27, 18 to, oh, right, this guy's weakened, so only 15 to defend against. But yeah, that's also going to be almost impossible. Any reason to do violence? Not really. Um, can I somehow kill the backliner and then still fully defend? No, no, there's nothing I can do here, unfortunately, right? All right, fine. Uh, yeah, let me just do the attacks. Yeah, I needed the vigil. This is the hand I needed last turn. Didn't get it, though. All right, let's weaken this guy again, and then I'll do Vigilance, and um, I'll keep the Flying Sleeves for when, when I'm in Wrath. Okay. All right, another 15. Should I do Wrath now? Yeah, let's do Crescendo, then Flying Sleeves, Strike, and then another Strike and Tranquility. Okay. All right, and then yeah, let's just uh, just need another eleven damage, which should be possible. Uh, well, not with this. Uh, let's do chrysalis and defend. Okay. All right, pressure points, and then okay, just need any any sort of damage card. Can I get yeah, crush runs is fine. Good. Okay, anchor is nice. Every uh, starting combo with ten block, as well as a cultist potion and tantrum. Yes, really good, really good card. Uh, remove a card or heal. I don't think I need the heal. I could remove the extra jack of all trades. It is handy, but uh, let's remove it. It's also a pretty cheap way to remove a card. Okay. Rem and knob. Oof, this is not a good hand. I'm not even sure if I should play the chrysalis. Um. Wow. Yeah, this is very disappointing. I guess, let me do... I'll do vigilance at the end. Oh boy. Uh... I mean, depends what crystals will give me, but I don't want to have a lot of skills in my hand. Uh, let's just do Empty Fist and Vigilance. Okay. 14. So, I mean, I can enter Wrath, but there's no real reason to. Let's do Crescendo. Finesse. Brush Joints, Flying Sleeves. Strike one, strike two. All right, awesome. Perfect this one. Good. We got the boot. Whenever you, whenever you deal four or less unlocked attack damage, increase it to five, as well as an ancient potion. And the Sea of Reality is really good. Flurry of Blows might not be a bad idea because I do have a few ways. So I have Vigilance, Tantrum, Empty Fist, Crescendo, Tranquility, and Eruption, of course. You know what? Let's take the Flurry of Blows. Yeah. Okay. Got Frozen Egg. Whenever you add a power card into your deck, upgrade it. That's good. And sentries again. Yeah, I think the sentries is, are, are the ones that I probably will have the most trouble with. Let's see what this gives me. Master of Strategy is pretty good. Actually, I've fully defended this turn. Let me do Miracle and Violence first. I'm hoping for a way to enter Wrath. Good. And then I can exit it too, right? So let's do Crush Joints, Flurry of Blows, Tantrum. Flurry of Blows again. And then... Is there... I guess if I get Empty Fist, that would be great. Let's see what the Master of Strategy gives me. Uh, no, no. I think I have to do Vigilance. And I guess I can kill here, though. Okay, so one down. I might have considered drinking the Energy Potion, actually, now that I think about it. Because... Can I kill here? Let's do Tantrum. Okay. Then Flurry of Blows. Eruption is almost enough, but not quite. So neither is Empty Fist. 
Uh, let's do Empty Fist Kill with the Flurry of Blows, then do Eruption, Flurry of Blows, and Flying Sleeves, okay? And then next turn, I'm pretty sure I should be able to kill with Tantrum. Awesome, all right, perfect this one. We got Smiling Mask, Merchant Card Remote Service, now always cost 50 gold, as well as... I should try to go for Highlander, so I don't think I'll take a second Empty Fist. I don't think I need Fasting either. It is pre-upgraded, but I don't have the energy. It would make a few cards really good, uh, particularly the Tantrum. And things like Finesse, right? But I really need extra energy. You know what? Okay, I'm going to take it and hope I'll get an energy relic. Then then it'll be worth it. All right, sorry about that. Okay, let's do Violence here. And uh, I kind of want to do Crescendo, right? So let's do... I'll take a little bit of damage, but I might be able to kill. Let's do Flurry of Blows, Crescendo. Then Crush Joints, Flurry of Blows again. And then, yeah, that's enough to kill. The Vulnerability really helps. We've got a Ball Miracle, which... I mean, I already have an energy potion, so I don't think I'll need it. And then between Halt and Just Lucky, let's go with the Just Lucky. Some scry capabilities. From the knob again. Yeah, it's too dangerous to do fasting here. Although, it would make the Tantrum deal 21 damage rather than 9, but I don't think it'll help. Uh, it's very tempting, though. Very tempting. But no, no, I don't think I can do it. Let's just do Tantrum and wait. Actually, yeah, it's, it would have been 21 instead of 15 because of the boot, right? Okay, 28. I'm going to try to kill here again. So let's do Miracle, Crush Joints, Tantrum. And then Eruption is 35. Good. All right, perfect. This one, we got Molten Egg. We're going to be adding attack into the deck upgraded. Duplication Potion. That's probably better than the Ancient Potion. Let's take it. Swivel, Empty Body. Let's take an Empty Body, another way to Exit Wrath. Okay, I got the Fungi Beast here. Uh, almost fully, actually with the Just Lucky, I am actually fully defended. Let's get rid of this and then just do a Strike and Chrysalis. I'll keep the uh, Flying Sleeves again for once I'm in Wrath. Or Divinity, I picked up a Blasphemy here, right? Yeah, okay. Back of all trades gives me Panacea, which means I can kill one of them without worrying about it. Okay, and then I can fully defend, good. All right, and then here, actually, it doesn't matter, right? I can just do Judgment to kill. Good. Got a Fire Potion, which I don't think I'll take. Evaluate, Reach Heaven. Yeah, I wouldn't mind a good attack card, so let's take the Reach Heaven. Not something I usually pick up in dailies. Upgrade two random cards. All right, got Flying Sleeves and Finesse upgraded. Good. And then I'm pretty sure I can perfect the boss, so I don't think I need to rest here. Let's upgrade. Uh, let's upgrade the Flurry of Blows. I do try to play it often enough. Okay. All right, Slime Boss, let's do Jack of All Trades, Secret Weapon. Kind of want to take the uh, Tantrum. Or or should I do the um, the Crush Joints? Uh, yeah, I already have a way to enter Rathia, right? So let's grab the Crush Joints, do that, and then Eruption. Okay. All right, definitely too early to play the Fasting here, so let's not do that. Instead, let's do Finesse. Violence, okay. And then reach heaven, and I have to be careful not to transform yet. Let's do just lucky. Okay, next turn I have flying sleeves, so I should try to transform then. All right, yeah, perfect. So I can do through violence, uh, flying sleeves, and then kill. Good. Okay, so we got uh, perfect the three out of four elites. That's not bad. Okay, Devotion Master Reality, not a huge fan. Devotion might be good, but it'll take a little too long to become useful. Definitely not Master Reality. I think I'll skip this one, and we'll try to go for Popper, which means I still have to remove two more cards. I had Violence and Chrysalis. Chrysalis should go first, but... All right, didn't get an Energy Relic, which makes the pickup of the Fasting a little more difficult to justify. Um... Yeah, I don't think I can I can avoid resting or avoid upgrading things. Pandora's box would give me well, it could give me possibly duplicates and possibly rare cards. So I don't think I'll take that either. So I think it it has to be the Black Star, at least drop initial relic when defeated. Okay. Alright, collector at the end. I do need some help for that. Hopefully I get some good cards uh until then. Three elite path. Yeah, left side. Pretty good. Not too many question mark rooms, um, but I will continue to maximize them. I don't have any curses yet, right? And the I don't have a lot of scry capability, so curses might be annoying. But let's see what what I get. Let's do jack of all trades. Oof, probably not want don't want metamorphosis. Uh, flurry of blows, and then uh, yeah, two strikes. 
Okay. Did I miss a third strike I could have played? I think I just completely missed that. All right, let's do defend here, then crush joints. Just lucky. Finesse is good, and then empty fist. All right, taking a little bit of damage here. Another 10. I definitely want to do Tantrum, but can I exit Wrath? I guess I have the uh, Empty Body. Tantrum won't even get through the block, right? But at least I can do Flying Sleeves afterwards. Okay, yeah, let's do Tantrum. And then more importantly, the Tantrum is put back into my draw pile. Actually, I'm... Oh, I could have killed. Ah, that was silly. I have to remember the Flurry of Blows. All right. We got a Weakness Potion, which I don't think I'll take. Bowling Bash. An upgraded Foreign Influence is actually pretty good. Bowling Bash would help for multi uh, or for fights with a lot of elites, but let's go. Let's go with the foreign influence. Okay, uh, I mean, I could get a curse out of it. Don't want any of those. Probably don't want the shame. Yeah, definitely don't need foreign influence. Uh, can't take another option. I would love a protect. Give me a protect, please. Yes, good. Yeah, protect is pretty good. Solid defensive card. All right, Sphere Guardian doesn't have the slow debuff. Have to remember that. Just lucky is fine. And then definitely reach heaven and crush joints. Okay. Probably could have played the crush joint. Well, actually, wouldn't have mattered. Jack all trades. Panache. Um, empty body is only seven block. Probably no need to do eruption. I don't have the flurry of blows in my discard pile. Yet, right? Yeah, let's just defend and uh, empty body. Okay. All right, so foreign influence gives me riddle withholds. Uh, yeah, fine, fine. And then let's do tantrum. Finesse. Violence. Let me do miracle first and violence. Flurry of blows, riddle withholds. That's actually enough to kill. Good. Okay, swivel crush joints. Let's take the swivel. I don't have it. And that's, actually, it's not a bad idea to have. Altus and chosen. This gives me cleave. Yeah, cleave is pretty good. I'll do crescendo violence and then let's do cleave tantrum and i could do empty body yeah fine let's do tantrum and then empty body maybe i should have played the miracle and played another attack that might have been a good idea okay jack of all trades discovery scrawl is not a bad idea yeah uh although hang on i can kill this guy let's do miracle scrawl flurry of blows finesse and let's do Eruption, Glory Blows again, and Just Lucky. Okay. Huh? 20 incoming. I can kill here. Good. Okay, Rushdown. Rushdown is actually a good idea because I do have at least two ways to enter. Three. Three ways to enter Wrath. And I would like the card draw. Let's take it. Now, I, now all I need is extra energy. Okay, Shell Parasite and the Fungi Beast. Let's do... Again, I can't do fasting. It's too tempting, but I really shouldn't shouldn't even think about it. I could do eruption and exit wrath with tranquility, right? No, that seems silly. All right, fine, let's do it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I dealt a little bit of damage. Otherwise, I wouldn't have dealt any damage, which would have been a little disappointing. Let's do rush down, violence. I can do swivel. Uh, see what the crescendo draws me. Jack of all trades gives me fourth up, which I don't need, and I can exit wrath with vigilance, right? So let's do the flying sleeves here. Actually, can I kill? 19 and another 20 is 39. Uh, actually, I can kill, and then that way, um, I'm only taking one damage anyway. No need to play the vigilance. And uh, yeah, I was going to say, I know that I'm not getting attacked this turn. I can kill. Okay. Prostrate follow up. Definitely follow up. Yeah, a decent attack card. Okay, yeah, this is where the um, Bowling Bash would have been useful. Um, so I do have an Energy Potion. I have a Duplication Potion. What would I duplicate, though? Empty empty Body? Can I somehow kill the Backliner? Actually, let's drink the Energy Potion. And then I think I'll do Eruption. So I could duplicate this. This would be enough to kill the Backliner. And then exit with the um, exit Wrath with the Empty Body. Or, or can I do something like Crush Joints Flying Sleeves? That'll be uh, 18 times 2, 36. Yeah, that would be enough. So maybe I don't need to play the um, Duplication Potion. Okay. And then I can Exit Wrath and wait. All right. Okay. 19. Protect this only 12. 
I mean, if I'm really desperate, I guess I can duplicate the protect. Not something I like to do, but fine. All right, another 19. Yeah, I think this is where my luck stops. I wonder if I should have drank the ritual potion as well. All right, let's do... Hang on, can I do something with fasting? No, that wouldn't be enough, right? It'll just be 10 and another 10 after that. Yeah, unfortunately, it's, it's the biggest shame is that I had to, or I, I wasted sort of two potions and still wasn't able to perfect. Yeah, a little unlucky, but uh, I guess yeah, if I had a tantrum or something else, I might have helped. Uh, foreign influence gives me follow up, which is fine. Let's do tantrum follow up. Flurry of blows, strike. I'm definitely going to play the vault, right? Let's do collect and vault. All right, and then tantrum again, and this kills. Yeah, just one turn I wasn't able to fully defend. We got blue candle. I'll play with curse cards, cannot be played. Whenever you play a curse, lose one HP and exhausted. So it's out of four. If you do not play any attacks during your turn, gain additional energy next turn. A blessing of the forge, and I already have both of these, so I can't take them. All right. Next upgrade. Tantrum upgrade seems good. Jack of all trades is not a bad thing to upgrade. I'll get two cards out of it. With the slow debuff, that might actually help. Uh, no, let me do crush turns first. The vulnerability really helps, especially with together with the slow debuff. All right, book of stabbing. Uh, almost fully defended. I could do something with tantrum and vigilance. Let me use the cultist potion here. So I think what I'll do is I'll do just tantrum and vigilance. I think that's fine. Okay. Eighteen. Oh, uh, boy. Uh, so even if I upgrade the Protect, it's not going to be enough, right? Yeah, because it's upgrade to be 16. So I'll just be 16 incoming rather than anything else. Uh, and there's no way I can draw cards. All right, fine. Let's do Flurry of Blows, Protect, and uh, that's it. Yeah, it's it's uh, unfortunate. Uh, I don't think I'll do Fasting again. So let's do Finesse. Eruption. Flurry of Blows, just lucky. Swivel is fine. And then Flying Sleeves, a regular strike. Should have flipped the order there. Okay. Yeah, there's no way I could have perfected this one. Probably should have saved the potion. All right. We got Captain's Will. At the start of your third turn, gain 18 block. And Strike Dummy, cards containing Strike deal 3 additional damage. As well as a Stance Potion. And yeah, fine. I'll take the Prostrate. I already have a Protect. All right, unseating top. Whenever you have no cards in hand during your turn, draw a card. I should really try to pay attention to this. i usually not doing well with unseizing top. And yes, let's risk it. I got perfect. Face of Cleric. At the end of combat, raise your max HP by one. Good. Listen, I don't think it'll be enough to get to 102 max HP, but it'll, it'll help me get close to that. All right, foreign influence gives me... Oh, a free bludgeon is beautiful. That's 64 damage, right? So let's do eruption, then bludgeon. And then I can do strike and uh, kill this guy with the empty fist. Why not? Okay. All right, six are coming. Uh, let me do follow up first. Then uh, jack of all trades, and I can just do empty body chrysalis. Okay. And then next turn I have full block here. So let's do. Uh, let's see what this gives me. Yeah, crescendo, reach heaven, and a strike should be enough. I messed up. How did I mess up? Oh, I forgot that the crescendo takes uh, energy. Could have ordered it differently. It's fine. Cut through fate. Really good. Yeah, good attack card. Allows me to scry. All right, Grim and Leader. Let me try to perfect this as the first elite on this act. So, nine. I do want to kill probably the Mad Gremlin, right? Let's try that. Let's do Prostrate first. Then, so, nine, six. That's 17. Well, it depends a little bit what I get with the Cutthroat Fate, but let's try it. Let's do Flurry of Blows, Cutthroat Fate. Eruption. Yes, yes, let's do the Eruption. Okay. And then it's not going to be enough to kill the back. No, it, it will be. Okay, good. So let's do Miracle, Eruption, and then Strike. Wait, this is... Oh, this this is enough. Okay, good. I can Strike the Gremlin Leader. I'm not getting attacked. That's nice. Uh, let's see what this gives me. The Bomb. That would be... Uh, might come in handy a little too late, but still, probably should play that. I should have played that first. Okay. Oof, getting attacked. Do you have a way to exit Wrath? Um, 
Let's do... Can I kill the minion? So wait, this is uh, 27 incoming. Um, I have 18. Uh, well, I, I should also try to kill this guy, right? So let's do... Let's do Vigilance. No. Let's do Violence first. Then Drink the Blessing of the Forge. That operates a lot of cards. Then I can kill this guy with Tantrum. Okay. Then do Follow Up. All right. And then Vigilance. Yeah, that would give me an up block. Okay. All right. And then the Bomb will deal damage at the end of this turn. Let's do Finesse. Uh, foreign Influence gives me... Uh, Flechette will only deal 12. Well, it's more than the others, so let's take Flechettes. Then Tantrum. Actually, I'll do the Crescendo first. All right. Flurry of Blows, Flechettes, and then Tantrum. Good. Didn't even need the bomb. Got Oddly Smooth Stone, Surge come with one Dexterity. And Kunai, every time play three attacks in a single turn, gain one Dexterity. So it's an Energy Potion. Like Water, am I in Calm often enough? I think I'll take... Uh, Seymour Fear would be better if I had extra card. Let's take the Luck Water. Yeah, that will hopefully help to defend against the Collector. All right, Centurion, Mystic. Uh, let's do Rushdown, Finesse. Jack of all trades gives me dramatic entrance, follow up, strike, and defend. I should have, again, played the defend first. I guess, yeah, I didn't really care for the extra decks from Kunai, so I could have played the defend first. Choke for free, meteor strike for free, but I won't get any orbs because I don't have any um, orb slots. So let's take the choke instead, okay? Let's do choke, swivel, reach heaven. And, uh, oh, I didn't realize I would kill. Okay, fine. Not getting attacked here. Let's do Eruption Tantrum. I should have flipped the order. Tantrum should have been played first because of the boot. Probably don't need the like water. Let's do another strike here. Actually, that should be enough, right? Okay. All right. Cut through Fade Prostrate. I already have both, actually, right? I picked up a Prostrate as well. So, nope. Can't take it. And, ooh, this is, this is a good event. So, 25 incoming. Let's do Finesse. Tantrum. Yeah, let's do Tantrum. Okay. Then I sh again should have played the defend first. So I guess it didn't really matter because of the boot. Then just lucky. Probably don't need this. And then can I kill this guy? 25. Yeah, that's exactly enough. Good. Okay. All right. He did coming. Let's do rush on Jack of all trades. Um, and then I think I'll defend here. Let me gain... Oh, I can't... No, no, I can gain um, extra decks if I use my uh, Miracle, which I should have done at the very beginning. And then I should be able to kill here. Good. Definitely want to fight a powerful fight. Oh, I, I didn't realize Face of Cleric will trigger twice. Oh, yeah, at the end of combat. So this is... That was my first combat. This is my second. Let's do Foreign Influence. Uh, yeah, not a huge fan. I guess I can do Follow-Up. Actually, no, I don't have a way to exit Wrath. Let's do Empty Fist. Finesse, Jack of all trades. Well, there's another Empty Fist. Um, maybe I'll do the Tantrum here. Play that first. Okay. And then just do Empty Fist 1 and Empty Fist 2. All right. 27. Uh, let's do Flurry of Blows. Reach Heaven is only 16. I guess if I do Crescendo, I can do Reach Heaven. Um, 36 versus 14. Yeah, let's do 36. And then I will probably still do the uh, empty body. And flurry close again. Okay. All right. Uh, rush down. Um, can't enter wrath easily here. So let me do vigilance. Strike, flurry close, and the skills. Good. Okay, we've got Peace Pub. You can now remove cards from your deck and reset. That should make it very easy to get the Popper modifier. And then Eternal Feather. For every five cards in your deck, heal three HP whenever you enter a rest site. As well as a Bottle Miracle. And Third Eye is good. Yep, don't have a copy of it at least. I don't think I'll remove the cards yet. I can remove them later on. Uh, Probably don't need the Tantrum upgrade. You know what? Let me upgrade that Jack of All Trades. Again, getting two Carlos cards will possibly give me something good and also get the slow debuff going. Okay, very nice to see Rushdown is early on. Let's play that. Sort of want to do Violence. I was really hoping to enter Wrath somehow. I mean, I still can with the potion, but I don't I don't need to. Cutthroat Fate is good next turn. And I'll just do Double Strike. Keep the uh, Flying Sleeves for when I'm actually in Wrath. Okay, everyone's attacking me. That's a little unfortunate. I do have the energy. I just don't have any 
defensive cards are not good ones at least. Let me see what the finesse draws. Okay, I guess I can do Flurry of Blows. So let's do Eruption. Flurry of Blows again. Okay, now I have some good defensive cards. 23. All right, that's enough to kill this guy. I'll take the Empty Body. Okay. And then let's drink the Energy Potion. Flurry of Blows, Flying Sleeves. Okay, so Empty Body will be 16. That's not quite enough. Uh, so it has to be another Defend and then Empty Body. Okay. All right. This turn I have 18 block, but I'm not getting attacked either. Still can't do Fasting. Uh, I think instead I'll do Tantrum. Uh, let me do... Uh, I think I'll... Trying to think if I should do Strike or... Wait. Um, so I don't have a way to Exit Wrath coming up other than the Tranquility. So let me do Empty Fist. Let's do Like Water as well. So Like Water and then Empty Fist. Okay. Alright, so here, let's see what the Ford Influence gives me. Pummel. And eh, not that useful. Let's take the Uppercut for free. Jack of all trades gives me, uh, unfortunately, a very unnecessary Mind Blast. Um, trying to think. Let's do Prostrate. Yeah, I don't think I'll play the Mind Blast at all. Maybe I'll... You know what? I think I'll enter Wrath here. Yeah, let's enter Wrath. And then I can do Uppercut for the Vulnerability. Flurry of Blows follow up reach heaven that's enough to kill awesome all right perfect this one okay uh let's see vault spirit shield no let's go with popper vault would have been okay but uh, i think popper is better and then i could take coffee dripper yeah i really need extra energy for that fasting to be with it so let's do it get energy at you start of your turn you can no longer remove uh you can no longer rest at rest sites violet lotus would be fine but let's go let's go with the coffee dripper All right, Donut Deck at the end. I got two Elite Paths on the right and on the left. On the right, I'll get four, five, six question mark rooms with a late shop. I haven't had a single shop yet. On the left, I get just three question mark rooms with the late shop. So yeah, let's stick on the right. Hopefully, I get the Courier or something. Otherwise, I might leave a lot of gold on the table at the end of this fight. Uh, oh, unfortunately, I can't. Well, I could enter Wrath and then hope I get something good. Ooh. Well, I guess now I'm hoping I can kill. Which is theoretically possible, I guess. Cut through fate. Um, yeah, I think reach heaven should be enough, right? Good. Okay, crescendo like water. Half both already. All right. Uh, definitely want to fight for the rare relic here. Okay, so not the best start. Uh, let's do empty. Uh, let's do defend or chrysalis. Let me do miracle chrysalis defend and then empty fist and follow up. I probably could have played that better. Yeah, I definitely could have played that better. Okay, so rush down for an influence gives me... Yeah, Bowling Bash is fine. Let's do Prostrate, Vigilance. Probably should have done the Empty uh, empty Body afterwards. Uh, let's do it now. And then Bowling Bash. Okay. Alright, yeah, it's getting worse. Uh, Impatience, Purity, don't really need any of those. Uh, let me, if I enter Wrath, I guess I can exit it with the Tranquility, but it seems silly to enter Wrath just for the Crush Joint, but that's, I think it should be fine. Crush Joint's just lucky. Flying Sleeves is good. Let's do Impatience. Flying Sleeves almost kills this guy. Seems like a waste, but sort of has to do it. And then Deceive Reality and uh, Tranquility. The free one, so I can do like water as well. Good. 19. Uh, yeah, now let's do... Well, let me do finesse first. Then eruption. Reach heaven. 36. Wait, I don't think I can kill here, right? So 21, 42, 36 is 58. Right? 42... No, 42, 36 is 78. I might be missing the... Um, Overkill modifier. Hang on, let's see. Uh, not the overkill, the slow debuff. 39, 23 is 40, uh, 66. Yeah, that should be enough, right? Awesome. All right. We got Tungsten Rod. That's really good. Whenever you lose HP, lose one less, as well as an Ancient Potion. Very nice together with the Blue Candle. Between Sanctity and Bowling Bash, I wonder if I should take Bowling Bash or Sanctity to have another defensive card. 
I feel like I have enough offense. Let's take the Sanctity. That's also card draw, which is good. Um, yeah, continuing with the question mark rooms here. Uh, well, this would give me my first curse that I don't really need, and I also don't need to um, heal. I also don't want to take madness or lose max HP, but of these, losing max HP is probably the least worst thing. Okay. Uh, so, yes, let's definitely remove a card and upgrade a random card. Yeah, I have the gold to support that. Let's do that, and then let's remove the chrysalis. And I got the eruption upgrade. Okay, good. I actually would like that to be upgraded sooner or later. Okay, I got the Dark Links here. Eight incoming and fully defended. Good. Uh, let's do Empty Fist Strike. I should have done Light Water first. I'll keep the Flying Slaves for later. Hmm. Uh, 27. Um, let's see. Let's do Just Lucky. Eruption is fine. I guess I'll do Strike, Strike. Get extra decks and then I can do Swivel. And maybe, maybe I'll do another Defend just to lose less HP. I could have done Tranquility, actually. That would have given me a little bit of block, too. Okay, so here let's do a free Eruption follow-up. That's enough to kill. Um, this is 18. Yeah, let me uh, kill the backline with Tantrum. Let's follow up you. And Tantrum is enough to kill now. Violence, uh, Flurry of Blows. I should have done Crush Joints a little sooner. Reach Heaven is almost enough. Yeah, let's do Crush Joints and Reach Heaven. We got a weakness potion, third eye. I already have a third eye, right? I feel like I barely have drawn it, but no, I have it. I don't think there's a reason for me to take prey, but I do have 34 cards and I need to get to 35 and I'm a little worried. So let's take it, sure. Okay. All right, giant head. So the sooner I enter wrath here, the better, right? Let's do eruption, cut through fate. Could do Sanctity, but no, let's grab the Tranquility, get rid of the Defend and Sanctity, actually, and then just do Swivel and hope for a good next turn. 26. Okay, this is not looking too bad. Let's start with the Reach Heaven. Or should I do Protect first? Yeah, because I will have to play Defend somehow or another, right? So let's do Protect first, then Reach Heaven, follow up. Then let's see what the Violence gives me. Ooh, through Violence is good. Okay, I'm going to do Miracle. I have to finish with Empty Fist, right? So Empty Fist, uh, so I can do one strike, then Flying Sleeves, then through Violence, 51. Yeah, I was hoping to deal more than 100 damage, but this will have to do. Okay. All right, do not get any attacked here. Yeah, I think, I think now this is the right time for Fasting. Let's do that. And then I can do Flurry of Blows, uh, Prey, and Empty Body. Alright, for an influence gives me another free bludgeon, good. Prostrate, uh, just, well, let me do insights first. Do I not have, yeah, tantrum is not going to come up anytime soon. Can I somehow do, oh yeah, I'm weakened too, which makes it harder to get the uh, overkill modifier. Let's do third eye. Actually, this looks fine. And then just, uh, I guess, defend, just lucky. Jack of all trades, good. Strike, and then uh, bludgeon. Yeah, it's only 45 damage. A little disappointing, I have to admit. All right, 30. If I, well, I guess if I enter Wrath, I could exit it. It'll just be difficult. Let's do Jack of all trades first. Oh boy, these are not good cards. I guess Violence is fine. It'll draw me a Tantrum. So let's do... Hmm. Let's enter Wrath here. Okay. Then Crush joins Flurry of Blows. Then uh, Strike. Hang on, let me drink this. Play these two. Then uh, let's do Violence. And then let's do... Uh, I have to do Tranquility. Actually, yeah, I have to do Tranquility. There's no way I can kill here, unfortunately. Even though I'm dealing a good amount of damage. Uh, so, yeah, let's do... I just didn't draw defensive cards. That was my problem. So let's do strike, tantrum. I wasn't that far off from being able to kill either, right? And then do tranquility. So I only take. This is so close. So I only take. I do. And I don't think I would have been able to kill even if I forethought the like water or something like that. I mean, might as well, but still. Yeah, unfortunate. I'll take the thirty damage. Might as well save the uh, potions for later. Okay, it's a bummer though. 
All right, we've got Dreamcatcher. Whenever you rest, you may add a card into your deck, as well as Duality. Whenever you play an attack, gain one temporary dexterity. Indignation follow-up. I think I'll go with the Indignation here. Yeah, that'll give me a good way to apply either Vulnerability or Enter Wrath. Okay, 24. Um, let's do Flurry of Blows, Eruption. Flurry of Blows again. Strike is enough to kill. Good. And then um, I guess I can actually fully defend with the Defend. I don't need to play the Tranquility. Okay, now I might need to exit Wrath somehow. Uh, let's do Swivel, Empty Fist. Okay. Then do the Flurry of Bloth, um, Tantrum. Okay. Flurry of Bloth again. Actually, does Just Lucky kill here? No, it's only eight. Uh, let's do Strike. Just Lucky is nine now. Good. Jack of all trades is fine. And then this is almost enough to kill. Okay. Now it is enough to kill. Good. Got fruit juice, good. Gain five max HP. Let's drink that right away. Collect foresight. Um, foresight is not a bad idea. Yeah, let's do foresight. Collect would have been fine, but I don't feel like I have an energy problem. All right, let's do flurry of blows. Follow up. Uh, regular strike is not enough. I think I'll do crescendo. I should have. Oh wow, I just messed up. I should have definitely played the um, crescendo at the beginning. In my mind, I was going to do it either way, and then I just completely forgot about it. Okay. Could have killed the Repulsor. Would have probably been a better idea. All right, let's do Swivel, Reach Heaven. And I'll wait. Okay. 20. Uh, let's do Rush Down. I wonder if I should... You know what? Let's trigger the uh, Unseen Top here. Like Water, Through Violence. Prostrate. Good. That way I'm fully defended. Just Lucky. Jack of all trades is really nice. Maybe I can get an attack out of it. Nope. And I see that's fine too, though. All right. Okay. Uh, get rid of this. Rest can stay. Uh, yeah, let's do finesse. Uh, insight. Then, I mean, if I do tantrum... Well, I guess I have a tranquility that I can use to exit wrath. Flurry of blows. Uh, no, let me do fasting first and then flurry of blows. Then a strike and another strike for a kill. Good. Okay, another fruit juice. Nice. All right. I uh, already have 25 points. Just need... Well, I would need much more. So let's take Sash Whip for the weakness. Another card I don't already have. And then, yeah, going this way for another Elite and two question mark rooms. We got Toxic Egg, so I got all the eggs. Whenever you add a skill into your deck, upgrade it. Okay. A little late on that Toxic Egg, but fine. Transform a card. I'm worried it'll give me... So I could transform the Violence... I guess it doesn't matter, right? I have to remove it either way. So let's let's transform it and see. Maybe it'll, it already gives me a an, an not rare card. No, it gave me Hand of Greed. But I guess I guess that's not bad. I can try to use it if I can. Will be easy. Rush down finesse. I think I have to try to trigger the unseen top here again because I don't see a good way to kill any of these. So let's do tranquility, empty body, gain energy, miracle, and then try. So thirteen. 18. I can kill one of them, at least. Okay. Uh, crush Zone is fine. And then Swivel. And do I get an attack? Uh, yeah, fine. Let's do Empty Fist. Okay. 39. Uh, yeah, this is not great. Can I do something here? Um, so I do have some good attacks, right? So if I do... Antrim with the slow debuff. Is there any way I can deal 183 damage? Not really, right? Yeah, I don't think there is. All right. In that case, I can't do Tantrum. So I have to do follow-up Sash Whip. Then Hand of Greed. And then Prostrate for 10 block, which is not too bad. But yeah, obviously not enough. 18. I'm fully defended here. Let's do Foresight. Uh, third Eye. Uh, Vigilance. It's probably not necessary. I think Reach Heaven and Crescendo are better next turn. Let's do Just Lucky. And then Def... Well, actually, I don't even need to defend. I can just do a strike. Okay. Another 30. Okay, now I need more defensive cards. So let's get rid of these two. Okay. Uh, yeah, wow. I'm not really getting lucky with my draw here. Uh, let's do Fasting... Defend like water. I'm gonna throw the uh, weakness potion because I'm a little worried. Okay. All right, not getting attacked here. Get rid of all of these. 
Okay, so let's do Foreign Influence for a Blood for Blood. Why not? Then Sanctity for Card Draw and a Reshuffle. Jackal Trades uh, Enlightenment is not going to really do anything. So let me actually get rid of it. I guess I could have played it. No harm in that. So, uh, yeah, let's do uh, Flurry Bliss first, then Crescendo. All right, Flurry uh, Prostrate first, then Flurry of Bliss again. Blood for Blood is 79. Wait, can I deal more than 100 damage here? Cut through Fate. Uh, I could do another follow-up. Oh, follow-up alone is already enough to kill. Uh, blood for Blood is not enough. All right, fine, whatever. We had White Beast Snatcher, Potions always appear in combat rewards, as well as before I take the Bottle Tornado, I'm not going to take any of these. So Bottle Tornado, pick up, choose a Power Crush, I just come with this card in your hand. That should either be the Rush Down, well, not should, that will either be the Rush Down or the uh, Foresight. Do I want any of those in my opening hand? So against Dona, I have to defend against 20 and right off the bat. I mean, it would be nice to have Foresight, but it will make it harder to defend. So I... Don't think I'll, I can take it. I still have... Oh, wait, never mind. Um, I was going to say I have another lead, but I only need two more relics. And I'm almost guaranteed to buy them at the shop, so let's not take it and skip these two. All right, Dark Links again. So I can probably do Eruption. Swivel. Oh, hang on. Let me do Finesse first. Then Eruption. Then Swivel. Reach Heaven. Okay. And then I, I should have played a Defend first. I might have actually been enough to kill the Backliner. Okay. All right, so Foreign Influence gives me Heavy Blade, which is not that useful. Maybe Flying Knee is better. And then I can do Crush Joints, Flying Knee. Okay. And uh, this would kill... Yeah, let's kill you and then do Vigilance. Okay. All right. Um, I do have some good block here. Let's do Rush Down, Crescendo... And then indignation. Okay, now if this does 78 damage. Uh, hang on, let's do a strike first. Again, trying to deal more than 100, but that's going to be very difficult. 96. Ah, oh, come on. Let me do a strike here, and then this is 102. Okay, good. I did get the overcome modifier at the end. Got a skill potion, protect crush joints. Already have both two. Okay. All right, first and only shop. Let's buy everything here. Hang on, that's actually 650 gold. Is there... Oh, wait, I first have to remove the last rare card, right? The uh, Hand of Greed. It's going to say violence. Um, yeah, let's get rid of that. Okay, so I said 650. Do I want any of the cards? Not necessarily. Maybe Carviality and uh, Dark Shackles is not bad, so that's another 150. That will be 800 total, which I can't afford. Okay, so I can't buy everything. So maybe between these two... Actually, because of it's Dona and Deca at the end, I don't think I need Dark Shackles. So let's take the Carviality. And then, yes, let's buy Grumminhorn. Whenever an enemy dies, gain energy and draw one card. Ink Bottle, whenever you play 10 cards, draw one card. And Toolbox, at the Star Beach Combat, choose one of three random colorless cards and add the chosen card to your hand. Let's also take the Power Potion. That's exactly... Okay, so that wasn't too bad. Only shot, but was able to spend literally all my gold, so... Do I want any of these? I guess... I'm trying to think. Secret Weapon. Secret Technique. Definitely not Forethought. Um... Maybe a Vigilance? Foreign Influence? Can't really decide. Let's take the uh, Secret Weapon. Be aggressive here. All right, well, I got Foreign Influence anyway. Let's take a Free Predator. Uh, sorry, I said... F Did I say Free Predator? No, I meant Free Predator. So, Swivel. Let's Secret Weapon. Maybe something Smith and I reach Heaven, which I can then make cheaper with the Swivel. So, 18. I guess I'll do... Let's do Predator... Then reach heaven. Actually, no, this would be enough with follow-up. Okay. And then I can do foresight. Strike. Strike. 24. Um, fine. I'll do I'll do strike you. Then swivel. And then reach heaven. Okay, good. And I guess I can do a cut through fate, sure. Uh, I'll do the prostrate this turn. Uh, sorry, I mean the rush down. All right, probably don't need fasting. I'm hoping to enter Wrath quickly so I can try to kill these guys. Yeah, let's do... I do need some block, though. So I'll do Third Eye. Ooh, through Violence is great next turn. So then let's do Crescendo. Through Violence is almost enough. Let's do Carve Reality. 
And then through violence is 52. And then smite kills. Good. Got a colors potion. I don't think I'll take. Cutthroat brilliance. Don't need them. Actually, you know what? I don't think I need the ancient potion. Let's take the colors potion instead. Okay. Oh, I, for some reason, I thought this was a fast fight, but no, it's taking me a long time. Um, nothing rare left, not, no duplicates left, so I don't need to uh, remove anything. And instead, let's upgrade um, maybe the Protect to have some solid defensive capabilities in my hand. Okay. All right, so, don't know Deca. My Blast is going to be, uh, what, 35 damage on turn one and then... Pretty much zero afterwards, so let's not take it. I think instead I'll go for the Master of Strategy. Okay, 20 incoming. Let's see what this gives me. Like Water, Nirvana, and Foresight. I think Foresight, another Foresight at least, is pretty good. Let's do that. And then I'll save the other potions for when I'm desperate. If I do Fasting, can I defend here? Depends on what the Master of Strategy gives me. Okay, so I do have Vigilance. I think it's worth it. Let's do Fasting. Then uh, Flurry of Blows and then Vigilance. Okay. All right. This is a great hand, although I might have trouble defending. Um, so let's do Jack of All Trades. Okay, good instincts. It's not quite enough, but it'll do something. For an influence, gives me Predator. That's pretty good again. So yeah, let's do Carve Reality. Then Sa wait, can I? No, I think I have to do Sash Whip. Let's do Sash Whip. Predator. Then Empty Fist. Okay, I have 10 decks, but that's still not enough. Let me see what this gives me. Swivel. Actually, I could use it to play the um, Hand of Greed, right? So 18 plus 16 is enough. So let's do Flurry of Blows. Swivel. Then Hand of Greed for 24. That's pretty good. And then I should have done the Good Instincts first. I guess I can do a smite as well. Okay. Ah, I should have kept the smite for when I had the crescendo plate. That was a mistake. 26. Let's take this will, but get rid of everything else. I have 18 already. Uh, if I enter Wrath, I won't be able to exit it, actually. Unless I can draw something with Sanctity. Yeah, too risky. So I'll do Rush Down. Uh, I'll do Swivel. Free reach heaven and then flying sleeves. Okay. Uh -huh. Alright, this looks fine. I'll keep the prostate. Let me get rid of the strike. Okay, 32. It wasn't that fine after all. Let's see what this gives me. Apotheosis, I mean, as nice, it's not going to help me perfect this. Uh, let's take it though. Upgrade everything. And do miracle. Cut through fate. All right, there's a Protect. That's good. Okay, so that's 24. Let's do... I have a way to exit Wrath. No, there's a Tranquility, but it's a little late coming up. I would draw two cards with Crescendo, but I don't want to rely on that. It'll be two out of uh, seven. Yeah, it's too risky. So instead, let's do Foresight... Wait, I need uh, one, two, three. Yeah, yeah, so I can do Foresight... A regular strike follow up. Okay. And then protect is 27 and prostrate is 15. So I need to play both. Okay. All right. So here I have 32 incoming. I do want to enter Wrath and I have to trickle it to exit if I need to. Other than that, actually, this looks. Oh, wait. No, I have to get rid of a few cards so I can draw five. So, Eruption, Through Violence, um, and then Defend and Finesse. So, let's get rid of these two. Okay. Oh, but if I do rush, uh, Eruption, I reshuffle my draw, my, my hand, um, which is fine, fine. Yeah, let's do Eruption. Okay. I don't have extra energy either, right? I do have to be a little careful here. Um, so, Through Violence is 68. That'll kill the Backliner. Also gives me a little bit of energy back. And then, uh, so 14, 18 is 32 exactly. So that would allow me to be fully defended with just one energy. So let's do Carve Reality, Smite. And then I should have done Finesse. Well, I guess it didn't matter too much. Just Lucky. Okay. And then um, I have to Exit Wrath, Exit Wrath, unfortunately. Let's do Sash Whip 2. And then Tranquility. Okay. 
All right, 54. Yeah, half time. Let's focus on offense. So get rid of everything that's not offensive. And then what I'll do is uh, let's do Flurry of Blows, Crescendo. Flurry of Blows again. Uh, I should have done Indignation first. And then Crush Joins, Hand of Greed is 87. And then Cut Through Fate. Okay. All right, at least I perfect all the bosses. So that's good. Um, let's see. 1353. Not bad. So out of the, what is that, nine elites, I perfected only four. So I got three on Act 1, um, I think only one on Act 2, and then sounds like... Oh, wait, did I not get a single elite on Act 3? Yeah, I think I got a little unlucky with the elites. There were only two in Act 3 anyway. But did get Beyond Perfect, Overkill, Well-Fed, uh, Popper, and Highlander. I like Shiny was relatively doable, and Librarian was fine too. A uh, combo could have been possible with the Flurry of Blows. I feel like I, there were definitely turns out playing a lot of cards, but yeah, I, I didn't really get close. Okay, I'm 14th right now. Um, exactly 50 points below Flignicum. I wouldn't be surprised if people just got uh, did better against the... Um... Oh, look at that. I'm tied with Vorpal. Uh, I didn't see that score before, so Vorpal must have played while I was playing. Uh, but yeah, so... I suspect that Flignicum, there are definitely a few elites where I didn't play my potions well, and I think if I got a little luckier with the potions, it could have perfected. So I'm just going to assume that's what Flignicum did, because, yeah, I only got four out of uh, out of nine, right? And then Vorpal tied me, and Sita got a few points below. Wait, am I? I I'm sorry, I completely forgot. Vorpal's name was there before. Yeah, I was reading them aloud. Anyway, I think that was a decent score. Not too great, not too too shabby. Like sort of sort of in the middle. I'm sure at the end of the day when I review the scores tomorrow, I would have I don't think I'll make it in the top twenty. Um, but still very happy with this run. So yeah, let me know in the comments if you went for a different strategy. I don't feel like there were a lot of strategies open here. I guess the big question is if somebody didn't go for Popper and did better. That might be a good question. So yeah, let me know what you did. Thanks for watching. Bye.